Still in the same tune of the end of the year and the readiness for it now in terms of telecommunication. State-owned enterprises Deputy Minister Kartika Wirjo Atmojo visited the Integrated Operations Center of Telcom Cell on Friday. He stated that Telcom is ready to provide a smooth network connectivity for business-to-business -business and business-to-consumer clients in this Christmas and New Year holiday period. The Deputy Minister of State-Owned Enterprises, Kartika Wirjo Atmojo, visited Telcom Cell's Integrated Operations Center at the Telcom Cell Smart Office Building, South Jakarta, on Friday. The purpose of the visit was to check the readiness of Telcom Cell's year-end holiday standby common post in providing good network connectivity service to the public during Christmas and New Year holidays. Hari ini tadi saya juga cek dengan Pak Ririk, Pak Heran, Direktur Network, memastikan bahwa kapasitas Telkom uh, untuk layanan baik di mobile, yang B2C maupun B2B, data semua ready dan bisa menangani peak uh, hour pada waktu uh, Natal maupun Tahun Baru. Dan juga untuk yang menarik juga untuk layanan yang di daerah remote seperti Papua, itu kita cover juga dengan satelit. Jadi kita satelit kita boleh pakai Starlink juga supaya ada dual coverage selain kabel laut juga dari satelit. Jadi memang uh, investasi dan pola kita melayani pelanggan juga makin beragam dan harapannya memang pelanggan makin merasakan bahwa kecepatan data dan kapasitas data di Indonesia semakin baik dan setara dengan di negara-negara lain. The CEO of PT Telkom Indonesia, Ririk Adriansa, accompanied the Deputy Minister in checking the personal, infrastructure, and the services of Telkom Cell. Ririk Adriansa said that Telkom's capacity is ready to provide connectivity for business-to-business -business or B2B clients and business-to-consumer or B2C clients. In addition, Telkom also covers the network connectivity to Eastern of Indonesia with Starlink Satellite which is owned by Elon Musk. He also stated that they have prepared combat Telkom Cell's mobile BTS to provide services for people wherever they are. Jadi kita juga termasuk memperluas coverage. Tadi yang transportasi tadi salah satu yang kita lakukan, teman-teman Telkomsel juga menambahkan ada beberapa jalur baru, ada tol yang baru dibuka itu kita juga menambahkan combat di bagian situ sehingga kita pastikan seluruh mobilitas masyarakat ini akan terus terlayani di mana pun mereka berada. The peak hour is predicted to happen during the New Year's Eve celebration and the traffic predicted to reach 19.5 terabyte. To ensure smooth network connectivity, Telkom adds up to 28 terabytes of capacity over the Christmas and New Year period. Agasafi Andri, Erwin Widiastama, or C Today.